guys, it is time for a new pregnancy update and I am in week 18 today. We're actually having a very special day ahead of us today. We are doing a little gender reveal afternoon fika in our home with Jared's family. So his grandparents, mom and dad, brothers and girlfriends, all are coming to our home. And my mom is going to be on the phone from Sweden, of course. But yeah, we're finally, finally going to know what gender the baby has. And of course, the gender does not matter, but the, oh, we just wanted to know. Jared really, really wants a daughter and I really, really want a son. So at least one of us is gonna be happy. No, I'm kidding. We'll be super happy with whoever it is and oh, I can't just wait for the baby's arrival to be honest. But uh, yeah, today we have a very nice day ahead of us. I am gonna put on some workout clothes, go out and go for a walk, listen to a podcast. And then when Jared comes back, we're gonna fix the fika together. We have also ordered a cake and we're gonna pop the balloon. <laughs> we're gonna do the very typical gender reveal, but I'm not so good in these things. And I just thought, okay, this uh, works perfect for us. And uh, so yeah, we ordered the balloon. It's in the office right now and our videographer is gonna come a bit later with it after we have had a bit of fika and uh, oh good I'm just super super excited and Jared's mom is texting me all the time like oh I'm so excited I'm so excited and uh, I am gonna dress now and I'll probably see you when we're getting ready for the, the gender reveal party bye Esling have fun <laughs> is it too early to play golf <laughs> They normally don't do activities this early, but I'm impressed. I'm really impressed. When it's about sport, I don't care. Okay. So this is my look for today's gender reveal fika. Actually, everything I'm wearing is pretty old. Both this top and these pants are old from Sarah and from Mango. But I do think that Mango still has these pants and if I can find them, I will link them. But I'm really doubting because I've had them for a couple of years now. And my slippers are from Flatter. These ones are actually new and they're so so comfortable. I live in these ones. Our guests will arrive in nothing. So yeah, I'm gonna fix with the last preparations. I hear Jared is in the kitchen fixing the last things and uh, then we will welcome our guests. In less than two hours we're gonna know who is in my belly. So so excited. Yeah, I thought I was going to prepare a bit at the table and also we got some flowers yesterday so I'm gonna see where I place them and also I'm gonna do the fruit platter and uh, oh, cut the fruit and put the pastries nice. Jan is picking up two chairs from the office because we will be 11 persons today and oh, but we don't have enough chairs so they pick actually Hey. Okay, they have just picked up the chairs and uh, yeah. We're almost, almost getting there. Let's start. So I'm gonna fold this, um, what's it called? Servette. Good, my English today is so bad, but whatever, just put the translation. Um, I'm gonna fold these ones. I bought these ones on Sarah home the other day. So pretty. Jad just arrived and he's vacuuming and he has just brought the chairs and everything. So we have divided the work a bit, but I feel like my part is a bit more fun. This is something I actually enjoy so much is to, decorate the table a bit. Also, I forgot to tell you, after our gender reveal with um, Jad's family, our friends are also coming over, or some of our friends are also coming over to eat some cake, if there is any cake left. <laughs> Let's hope. I'm also going to show you the cake very, very, very soon. I just finally decided to go for a white cake with like green um, flower decorations. Feels like it goes a bit with the theme, and you know that I love green, so... Anyway, almost, almost done here. Then we're just gonna put the plates and I'll show you the final result of the table. It's such a simple way, by the way, to fold um, like this. And then I'm just gonna have, I think I'm gonna use our Matteo's um, plates in oyster. I think that can be really pretty. This is a table so far and now I'm just gonna add the fika in here in the middle and maybe a flower as well. So here we have 
our little table set up. We have some sweets for sweet toots like me and some salty and the cake. In here is also the color um, blue or pink. We don't really know yet. We have some fruit and chocolate and some cheese because Jad loves cheese. I am really, really happy with this little setup. I hope everyone is ready for some fika. So here we have him, dad to be, eating for his life. Also you're eating just before the guest comes. Also this is Jad in a nutshell, guys. Okay, it is time to pop the balloon. What do you think it is? Yeah, what do you think it is? I dreamt it was a boy to, tonight, so I think boy. Boy? You? I also think boy. Let's see. I just want to say I'm so sorry for the little cliffhanger. It's two days later and uh, yeah, I promised my girlfriend that before putting anything on social media that of course they want to know when they want to meet up in this. So I keep my promise, but you will know in a near future. And also me and I want, want to be in this little secret bubble for a tiny bit more. Do you think we were right or wrong? Do you think it's a boy or a girl? Yeah, it was just... Uh, Oh, we're super 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 happy and uh, what else did I say but yeah I also and I also want to say really fast thank you so much for all your messages and DMs and comments here on YouTube I have been reading all the comments and like every single comment and every single message I have been reading and just crying I don't know if it's because I'm so sensitive but also like you're so so nice and it's just unbelievable for me that so, so many of you have followed me for years already and uh, are with me or are with us on this journey it just feels so so crazy but uh, yeah i just wanted to say thank you for that but now please let me know in the comment field you think it's a boy or girl also today we are going to the gynecologist we're gonna see how the little one is doing i think i've told you before but we were moved um from the 6th of march to the 25th of february because the baby was measuring big but the thing is that next year february has 29 days so we were moved, moved quite a lot of days but they said that also the curve can slow down a bit um, in the middle or in the end and now I'm in the middle so maybe today uh, it's measuring more normal let's see maybe we will have to change blueberry to giraffe or something <laughs> I always call, call Gerard, Gerard the giraffe when we come home from the hospital I'm going to show you what we got from the baby's uncles and the grandparents and uh, oh, some gifts that we got that was so so cute but uh, we have to hurry up now we have to go to the gynecologist let's see how the little one is doing let's go good i'm just super super excited and uh, yeah i thought i was going to show you my look really fast before we're going there so my shirt is from arket but long time ago my bag is from celine and then we have these sunglasses they're actually new i got them from uber salon and then my jeans just like in the la last vlog these ones are also from genetricoa low waist jeans I sized up uh, two sizes, perfect. Very, very big on me, I, I mean, you can really see it here, but uh, with the belt, everything is fine. And then my loafers are from Flattered. You know that these ones are my absolute favorites ever. I can walk in these ones for kilometers. I actually had a discount code last week on my Instagram. Maybe I can ask them to get one for YouTube as well. I can put it here. But yeah, these are my favorite, favorite loafers ever. And I use them any month of the year, which is so nice. Like in the summer, I wear the dress. And now going to autumn, it's still very warm in Barcelona. But going to autumn, I still wear them. And winter, and oh, they're just the most perfect loafers. But yeah, anyway, guys, we are going now. I'm going to get you out and we are going to see our little blueberry. hospital now to see the little blueberry in here but anyway I'm, yeah you copied my look today yeah for sure you did after the visit we're actually gonna go to a baby store because we got a super nice gift card from Anne Marie and Danny that oh, we can't hold ourselves we're gonna go there mm -hmm. right after this and probably have think a think about what you need yeah, not I what you want no, no, but not what I want what this one wants <laughs> Yeah, 
it's a bit creepy seeing your baby in 4D in, in week 20, but we feel like it looks very much like Gerard so far. Yeah, it's totally my copy. <laughs> We're gonna have some lunch now in Secrets by Faria. We always order it home, but we're gonna have lunch here. Everything looked super, super good with the baby, and uh, oh, it's just crazy. It's just so crazy to see that. I mean, you cannot really see it good in, in week 20, but what we saw, it's a clone of the jaws. Like the lips, and like you already see the jaws are. Completely, completely like Gerard, so yeah, it's what we think. We end with my nose, so we think it's a mix. When in the photo, it looks like a clone. We'll see when it arrives, uh, what it looks like. I think it's gonna be a mix, but um, oh, what we saw was a mini Gerard. Food is here, looks so so good. It's a new Don't you menu. want mayo and ah, oh, yeah, there's it. I always order it burger. <laughs> It's such a good, it's a vegan burger, no. but it's... Ah, oh, it's not the vegan one. It's a new one, yeah, it's vegan, but it's a new one. So oh. I don't know how it tastes. Okay, because the other one they have is amazing. They don't have the other one they used to have. They changed. Nay, I have to write them. We are done with our lunch and we're actually going to go to the baby store where we got the gift card from our friends. So yeah, let's go and see if we can find some baby clothes. Yeah, I know. I s that's so crazy. I actually surprised that with the box like this. Oh, everything is so cute. It's actually not a shop, but it's like a showroom, and they have all of these things here. So this doll, you know, this doll actually weights and measures the same as a baby of two months. Really crazy. Yeah, also so. So guys, we just came home and oh, everything looked absolutely perfect. We didn't get the measurement today because it, um, the baby didn't stop moving, but the weight and everything looks absolutely perfect. So I am very, very happy, or we are very, very happy with that. And also we got to see it a bit in 4D. Normally don't they don't recommend us to watch it maybe in 4D in, in week 20 because they don't have any fat or anything. So yeah, we will see. It's probably such a mix between both of us, but what we saw was like, okay, <laughs> it definitely looks like Gerard. Also, I want to tell you this thing. We, so in March and no, in January, I think even, January and February, we worked on a dress that was going to launch this autumn. And I had no idea that I was going to get pregnant or anything this autumn or this summer. But this dress is literally the most perfect dress, no matter how pregnant you are. And I'll put the video here while I'm talking, but it's just the most perfect, perfect dress we have ever created. It's the same material as the Noir dress. If you have the Noir dress, you know the feeling. It's very stretchy. And of course, you don't need to be pregnant to have this dress, but it's just so nice that I can wear this one while being pregnant. And if I don't find the dress for New Year, at least I will have this one that is so, so elegant. And I love that you show the the shoulders and oh, it's just such a, it's such a basic, but such a classical and beautiful and feminine dress. And I'm obsessed with it. It's so nice because so many of my girlfriends when they have been pregnant and I've also seen so many of you guys tagging especially these dresses the Stockholm dress and the Noir dress when you have been pregnant and also the one the Astrid blouse that I was wearing in the photo shoot but Astrid blouse has been sold out for so long now but yeah this new one I am obsessed guys even if you're pregnant or not pregnant like this is I thought I was going to end this vlog with another baby haul. I'm gonna show you a bit what we got from our gender reveal party. So from Jazz's little brother we got the cutest cutest little Ralph Lauren <laughs> polo. How cute is this one? Right. So freaking cute and this is Jazz's favorite color so he was very very happy. And then we have like the first thing you wear. This is from Jazz's big brother and also the, uh, this um, polo is also from the brother's girlfriend of course. And this is from Jared's older brother and his wife. And I just think the details are so, so cute. What is this? And little hat, of course. And then we also got this pyjama from Jared's little brother. And the material is just so, so soft. It's like a little, oh, we love this one. And it's for one to three months. So it's perfect for the spring to be home and when it's a bit colder and everything. And then we got a bunch of toys from the grandparents and from Gerard's mother's brother, Sophie the Giraffe. It's so crazy because I was talking with my, with Gerard's brother's wife about this, that it feels like everyone has this and the kids loves it, but I don't really get, I don't, I don't get it, but apparently it's very, very nice. 
so so cute and also here in the baby room we have bought these frames that we thought we were going to put some not photos but maybe some child paintings or something i don't know we will see maybe pippi longstrump but yeah we're gonna hang them in the room here that was it for today and uh, yeah let me let me know if you if you have any ideas of what i can film and all these things during these pregnancy updates but yeah i don't think that this vlog was so long but i hope that you guys enjoyed it either way and i'll see you probably next week or in two weeks Thank you.